my god! Oh my god! Obviously, you got a story and enough video to say, no man, look what I pulled out of the river. Definitely. And everything else that day, but for sure. It's better just not to be holding on to it, you know? Let's see how this is gonna go. You don't want to be holding something that somebody's looking for. Yeah. What may pop up What's later. going on, everybody? Welcome back to another brand new video of Depths of History. Today, I've made it back out to the Chattahoochee River. And last time we were in this particular area, I found five guns with my friends at a bridge that's just a little bit north of here. So we're hoping today that we can find a bunch of cool stuff in the river. I've never dove this bridge before. If you're liking these scuba diving videos, don't forget to press that like button and subscribe. And also press that bell notification. It keeps you updated on every single new video that I post. We also have the new merch website on Online. If you'd like to use code DOH10, you'll get 10% off your first order. I brought my friend Bobby with me today, who was in the last episode where, I mean, that was a crazy experience, that was. man. We, let's throw up a clip now and see what happened on that day. I'm also here with my friends today from high school. This is my buddy Adam and also Danielle. If you'd like to check out her TikTok, I'm gonna have it linked in the description below and also his Instagram. Bobby, what do you think we're gonna find today, man? <sighs> Hoping. I want to call the bomb squad again. The bomb squad? To if the water's clear. The water's clear. It hasn't been clear for two weeks, and we've been picking up trash, you know, picking up lures, fishing poles, basically anything that we can find. With the tubers that go down this river, too, I'm telling you, we're going to find some phones and different mm -hmm. stuff like that. So it's going to be really fun. So I've got my scuba tank today that's going to allow me to stay underwater for an hour and 30 minutes, if not more. I got this tank from Diver Supply in Marietta, and let me show you the full face mask that I just got recently. I've got this full face mask I'm going to be using under the water, and the great thing about this is I'm going to be able to talk to you guys underneath the water which is something different the water is very clear today so I don't think I'm gonna have to use a light but if I get underneath the bridge over there I've got this light to help me see anything at the bottom that I may miss or not see I've Something. already pulled one out so all right so Danielle I mean you haven't even <laughs> you, you didn't even like really get in the water you were just kind of like looking from on top and look at this oh it's got coins in it too you see mm -hmm. it those yeah. pennies nail so there was a razor blade like part of it broke off oh, right yeah here. I can open it because I got gloves yes please all right, There's so like herbs. yeah, we're gonna check out what's in here. This is definitely like a voodoo jar. So, okay, we got some pennies, some herbs. Oh, we've got needles. What the heck is that? Some sort of like stone. This is like a geode. Like a crystal or something in there. Oh, there's a note at the bottom. There's another razor blade. If you guys see inside, there's a note at the bottom. I'm gonna try to get that out. And then look, these are little scissors. Look, a little a little amethyst crystal right there. That's really cool. Check that thing out. So I'm hoping. Spring. There we go. Okay, here's the note. Oh gosh. It's probably written on wax paper. If not. Do you want me to do it without? Because. Yeah. We could leave it out in the sun for a little bit. That's a good idea. It's a bunch actually. of old rocks. I say we leave it out like in that. the sun for yeah. a little. Yeah. Let's leave it out in the sun, and then when we come back. We'll take a look at this whole entire jar and see what exactly was in here, but awesome find, Danielle. That was really cool. All right, I got Bobby over there. Danielle and Adam are on the shore. Let's go find some good stuff today, guys. All right, we got a Sprite can. We got to put that in the pot. Oh! 
over. Oh, it's stainless steel too, so we're gonna be able to get some, some serial numbers off that for sure. Another gun, and we're gonna be able to get this one to the police. And we're gonna go ahead and put it in here. Oh, old Pepsi bottle. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at that right there. A little bullet. Oh, another Pepsi Cola. Another old bottle. He's having a Coca Cola. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Check that thing out, man! Oh my word! Check that out, man! Oh, it's some sort of like... I don't know, I want to say this is like some sort of rifle. That is way cool! There's a sandal floating away. Bobby's right there. We're gonna keep searching this area. There's gotta be more stuff out here. I gotta lift this log up. Ah! No! Oh my. No! No! Oh my word. Man, that is so old, an old Dr. Pepper bottle. All right, so we just made it out of the water. We found some really cool things today in the river, picked up a bunch of trash, and the water was so clear today. All the time we're in Georgia, we're scuba diving in the Chattahoochee, and they always release the dam, causing the water to just get super muddy. And that's what we've been working with for the past two weeks, but today it was great. We were able to find some cool things, and I came across two firearms and one little witch jar that I'm gonna open for you guys right now. It's for the so video. bad! Not so fun. Danielle, in the, <laughs> the witch jar, you found this little piece right here? From what I can read, it says it is from 02 25 18, so it's from 2018, and it says, Dear Guides, Protectors, please remove negativity, hex, curses, or any harm from me. It's any really hard to read though. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty cool. And it said, it, yeah, it even does have the date on it. Yep. It's only one question now. Bobby, are you gonna go through the other jar? Oh, yes. I'll go through it. Oh, he's you can. No, I'm washing. Oh my! What is that? There's a note in there. Oh, look, there is a note. You see it? That see the paper coming out? What, yeah, what it does doesn't. That say? It doesn't smell that great. What does Harm, that say? hammed, Muhammad. There's oh more. my gosh! What the heck is all that? Look, there's worms in there. That is disgusting. It's, I believe it says Allah, Muhammad. I believe this is Allah. Here, put more water in the jar and pour it on it. Adam's really? gonna get some more water for it. Oh gosh. Oh, it smells so oh my horrible. God, smells oh bad. my gosh. Oh yeah, it's spices, herbs. It smells awful. It smells, it smells so horrible. <laughs> it smells very bad, very bad. But I want to know what those notes say. Sure, as well. You saw the Abdul. I think they all say the same thing. Yeah, I think they do too. Oh my. Oh, it smells so bad. Oh no, this is Wait, something that's different. That's is different. That's is different. Nikan. Nikan brown. That's yeah, Arabic. Something. something like yeah. Muslim. We're gonna have to Google it. <laughs> she said she found the full name oh. of the person. So they have Salim Abdullah Muhammad, but this is the guy that they got beef with apparently. Nineen. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Brown. Look, Adam's already searching it up. He's like, let me look yeah, at this Google up. It. <laughs> wow. Wait, 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 what? Uh, apparently it's a dude <gasps> who had no. abuse on a minor and a woman. No, no, no. Are you serious? Mohammed Adwala Salim, 77, mm. who founded the Institute of the Islamic Education in El Jain. Yeah. No. I'm not okay with that. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Wow. He's on probation. Right so tonight. someone wanted bad things to happen. <laughs> How's it going, sir? Yeah, no, I was out there the other day when they found the two flat bombs. Oh, you were? You were out there? Yep. Man. Well, how convenient. We didn't even have to call you. You just drove over here. <laughs> right, yeah. Did convenient. you get a call or, or no? Uh, you were just driving I over here? I was coming out here to let my dog take a break. Oh, man. Oh. There you uh, go. Not really, but okay. So you got the police here right now. They're gonna actually check out 
uh, what we found today in the river. Right now he's taking, he's going to take a look at the uh, the firearms that we were able to find today. All right, let's take a look at them. All right. Uh, You'll find anything else interesting today? Um, yeah. bunch of like some some bottles and some, some different. Jars, uh, so that's fun. Which oh, jars? Yeah, we're gonna clean. Like we're gonna clean all that stuff up. But it was some sort of like witch jar, and from what I've heard, they do like rituals, I guess. What is Man. It? So you got. Whatever. So we got a witch a witch jar right yeah, here, yeah, and then we've got a witch jar down there. Another one. So we found two of them. I'd have left that in there. <laughs> you would have. <laughs> Don't you get some bad spells or something when you take it out? Of it? Hey, yeah, probably. It probably. Me, Maybe it defeats the spell. That's what I'm hoping. It's getting trash out of the river anyways, well, that, which is yeah, good. Well, those yeah. yeah, those are the guns right there. Well, it's interesting. Mm -hmm. That's definitely a sawed off something. Because you can tell from the, the barrel, it's uh, you can tell it's not an even cut. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's sawed off for sure. I got you. What else you find? There's some broken bottles. Yeah, bottles. Bottles and yeah. yeah, old wrench. Yep. All right. So who wants to? Uh, who brought it up? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Come on. I know some people. Well, no, just because of. Uh, Everybody's been finding stuff recently, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. now they're, instead of people keeping stuff, they've been calling over the past I'm couple weeks, so now we're getting Have a little more. Have any of them been linked to anything? Oh, yeah. This I'm surprised, yeah, too. Is... Stop in the wet. You can find something <laughs> down. Y'all going over there? Yeah, we're going. Well, yeah, that's where I was going. going. I was taking the dog to use the bathroom and then going to the bridge again. Is that just an anchor? Or a One weight? of those is a weight. We'll see how this is going to go. Yeah. Ain't nothing growing out of this but crabs. <laughs> is it good most of the times like for those guns like that to turn them i mean to turn all of them in right most of the time it, yeah, it can never hurt right yeah you, you don't want to be holding something that somebody's looking for yeah what may pop up later that's the truth yeah uh obviously you got a story and enough video to say you know man look what i pulled out of the river definitely and everything else that day but it's better just not to be holding on to it you know definitely no, i agree if you want to report and come by after five days. Five days. So okay. The system, all that kind of stuff. Uh, you can, okay. If you if you really want it for whatever. Really want it? Yeah. So, just to. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So, awesome. So I just give them this number, or yeah, I just you, call them. You can pick one up. Perfect. Awesome. I appreciate you, yeah. Officer Bolton. Boltman. Boltman. Thank yep. you. Hopefully, no bad juju will come out of that. <laughs> Yeah, that's the truth. All right, everybody, so I've got Bobby, Adam, and Danielle with me. They were all alongside the river today as we were scuba diving. Bobby, you found some cool things. You found yeah. that uh, just like a bunch of bottles and a bunch of different other items. If you'd like to check out his channel, I'm going to have it linked in the description below. Danielle. Witch's Jar. <laughs> Witch's Jar. If you guys would like to check out her TikTok, I'm going to have that linked in the description below. She actually took some videos of today's events, and she might make it into a TikTok. Might not. Who Maybe. knows? We'll see. But Adam... You've got an Instagram too, right? Yes. <laughs> so I'm going to link that down in the description as well. Go send them some love. Tell them that Britain sent you. But with that said, it was an amazing day. Found those two guns. One of them was like a break barrel pistol, and then the other one was a sawed off 22. It's great that we can turn in those items to the police. Like and subscribe and press that notification bell. We'll see you guys on the Bye. next one.